Is it time to buy or sell NVIDIA stock? In this video, we're diving deep into NVIDIA. Our initial report was published on our website on Wednesday, the 8th of May, 2024, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since May 3, 2024, our system has ranked NVIDIA as a buy candidate, giving it a score of 3.28. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. The stock has seen a gain of 1.83%. This translates to an average return of 0.46% per day since it was listed as a buy candidate. The stock lies in the middle of a very wide and strong rising trend in the short term, indicating a further increase within the trend. The current three-month trend suggests a potential 13.17% change over the next three months, with a possible return between negative 2.52% and 26.4%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a 119.22% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between 61.89% and 146.93%. This translates to a price range of $1,463.64 to $2,232.58 after a year. Our latest daily update for NVIDIA includes the headline, NVIDIA stock price down 0.157% on Wednesday. The NVIDIA stock price fell by negative 0.157% on the last day, Wednesday, 8th May, 2024, from $905.54 to $904.12. During the last trading day, the stock fluctuated 1.98%, from a day low at $894.20 to a day high of $911.94. The price has risen in six of the last 10 days and is up by 13.47% over the past two weeks. Volume fell on the last day along with the stock, which is actually a good sign as volume should follow the stock. On the last day, the trading volume fell by negative 11 million shares, and in total, 32 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $29.07 billion. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $133.77, and the lowest price was $171.20. Currently, the price is negative 575.88%, or negative $770.35 below the 52-week high of $133.77, which is also the all-time high for stock. Analyst Ratings On Tuesday, May 7, 2024, it was reported that Goldman Sachs gave NVDA a buy grade with a hold action. On Tuesday, April 30, 2024, it was reported that UBS gave NVDA a buy grade with a hold action. On Monday, April 15, 2024, it was reported that Piper Sandler gave NVDA an overweight grade with a hold action. On Monday, April 15, 2024, it was reported that Citigroup gave NVDA a buy grade with a hold action. On Tuesday, April 9, 2024, it was reported that Morgan Stanley gave NVDA an overweight grade with a hold action. Analysts have given NVIDIA stock a general strong buy rating. They rate the P-E ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a strong buy rating. The following signals have been identified for NVIDIA. 
the NVIDIA stock holds buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages, giving a positive forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general buy signal from the relation between the two signals, where the short-term average is above the long-term average. On corrections down, there will be some support from the lines at $881.65 and $874.43. A breakdown below any of these levels will issue sell signals. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Monday, March 25, 2024, and so far it has fallen negative 4.83%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Volume fell together with the price during the last trading day, and this reduces the overall risk as volume should follow the price movements. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal, pivots, sell signal 32 days ago, Bollinger, buy signal 3 days ago, short-term moving average, sell signal 7 days ago, long-term moving average, buy signal 5 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal four days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see short moving average, sell signal seven days ago. The long-term moving average, buy signal 129 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 119 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support risk and stop loss for NVIDIA. NVIDIA finds support from accumulated volume at $875.28, and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock has average movements during the day, and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the stock moved $17.74 between high and low, or 1.98%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 4.65%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for NVIDIA, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per-share earnings. A high P.E. ratio could mean that the stock is overvalued or that investors expect high growth rates in the future. In other news, the next earnings report for Q2 2024 is expected on May 22, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates are at $5.49. Keep an eye on these numbers as they can greatly impact stock prices. Now, let's discuss some potential day trading levels for NVIDIA. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for NVIDIA is at $908.88. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, NVIDIA encounters its first support level at $875.28. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for NVIDIA from multiple analyst sources is a strong buy. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On the 8th of April, 2024, Robertson Donald F. Jr. conducted an insider buy of 1,337 shares of common stock. On the 8th of April, 2024, Robertson Donald F. Jr. conducted an insider buy of 330 shares of common stock. On the 5th of April, 2024, Stevens Mark A. conducted an insider sell of 5,500 shares of common stock. On the 5th of April, 2024, Stevens Mark A conducted an insider sell of 5,700 shares of common stock. On the 5th of April, 2024, Stevens Mark A conducted an insider sell of 11,500 shares of common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, 
We've calculated the insider power to be negative with a ratio of negative 8.840. Overall, insiders purchased 1,047,553 shares and sold 1,260,880 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $859.61, a decrease of 4.92%. This stock has medium daily movements, indicating medium risk. There is a sell signal from a pivot top identified 31 days ago. Is Nvidia stock a good buy? Several short-term signals along with a general good trend are positive and we conclude that the current level may hold a buying opportunity as there is a fair chance for Nvidia stock to perform well in the short term. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Thursday, May 9th, we expect Nvidia to open down negative $0.7 and start trading at $903.42. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.